News for Jack starts right now with a breaking news alert. You're looking live at Jacksonville University, which was just given an all clear after a violent threat was made this afternoon. The sheriff's office says it was an emailed bomb threat that caused quite a scare among students and their families, many of whom called our newsroom. They were frantic. At least four other colleges or universities around the state also received threats. Daytona State College, Southeastern University, Florida Southwestern State College, and the University of Tampa. Nothing suspicious has been found at any of these campuses. News 4 Jacks reporter Joe McLean joins us live from JU with this update. More on this. Joe. And this update coming in just just minutes ago that this uh, campus was cleared. What we know right now is that Jacksonville Sheriff's Office responded quickly with canine units. They say they've thoroughly searched the JU campus and verified it is safe for uh, everyone to return. Uh, they thank everyone for their cooperation. Now, what we know is they the, they send out an announcement saying JU a JU staff member earlier today received an email from what they have described as an individual threatening violence to members of our campus. Now they say they take the threat seriously and they said they immediately activated their emergency plan. They say they plan for uh, responding to this sort of situation uh, and they issued that campus wide uh, notification text uh, social media channels. Uh, they say Jacksonville uh, Sheriff's Department responded quickly. They helped everyone get evacuated. They swept the property uh, and they're continuing to work uh, to investigate uh, uh, to learn more uh, out of an abundance of caution. They say they're going to have extra patrols next week from JSO here on campus as an abundance of, of caution. Now, we're going to have more information on this on newsforjacks.com, but and just I'll tell you, in the last 20 minutes or so, we did see the JSO officers break down the uh, barriers that were on the perimeter of campus. We saw cars steadily streaming back in, so an obvious de-escalation here, and uh, obviously uh, a clear scene here now as the investigation into the source of that threat continues. Reporting live tonight, Joe McLean, Channel 4, the local station.